Welcome back, adventurers. Today we embark on the final step of this Baldur's Gate 3 journey. It is time to confront the Elder Brain. As you can see, I have Minsk and Boo, Scratch, Fern, Gale, and Shadowheart at my side. I've done no reading on this. I've watched no reviews on this game. I'm going into this completely blind. Time to bring this journey to a close. I'm currently at the Morphic Pool Dock Waypoint. And we're going to be taking this little skiff right here. Out to the Elder Brain. With all three nether stones in our possession, it is time to go to the Morphic Pool and face the Elder Brain. We should head to the sewers. There is no turning back. Pristine darkness in every direction. Silence but for the gentle, rhythmic slap of water on rock as your vessel cuts through. What the heck? That looked so weird. That guy's a hell of a swimmer, isn't he? Wearing like 200 pounds of armor. Hopefully our allies show up at some point. Can you smell it? The brine. It's infused with magic. The brain is here. I should mind my stab. Should be good to go with supplies. I did stop at one of the vendors before I turned on the recording today. I don't think we have any more use for gold, to be honest with you. I do have a use for potions of speed, though. true test of my Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play. Do I have a shovel on me in the final episode? Nothing interesting buried here. Nothing. Oh, okay. There's nothing buried there. I do have a shovel. Interesting. Why is it not letting me dig? No use digging here. No use digging here. Oh, I haven't seen a dirt mound pop up like that before without a chest in it. Unless there's a mechanic that I'm not aware of. Now. 
place looks so cool. No one stop me yet. Is that a bunny that just ran by? Oh, intellect of ours. Of course. The only thing I didn't get were potions of psychic resistance, which I should have done. Because the Elder Brain is all about that psychic damage, according to the lore, of course. <clears throat> Might be able to make some, actually. Psychic requires any sublimate, which I don't have any right now. But we can't do that. Yeah, I think we're going back over here. This is the calm before the storm. Take it all in. Scratch is telling us something. Where's Fern? Oh, Scratch was telling us that Fern wasn't with us. Fern's stuck on the ground for some reason. There you go, girl. Now we got the whole game. does look like an ambush. I was about to say, this looks like a battleground. Oh, Boo! Come here, Boo! No, you can't make it up there, little buddy? There we go. <laughs> I'll gladly bring Boo over. Game looks quite different from down here. Alright, so what I'm gonna do here is... Let's see, I don't see any enemies around here. But let's go ahead and sneak Wolf ahead. Out of sight, out of sight. With Scratch and Burn. We've come all the way from the misty forests of the north. Now we're fighting an Elder Brain. Can you believe it? What a story. It looks like an ambush, but I'm not seeing anything. See how the hamster stalks his prey. keeps doing that, it's going to be really hard to hold concentration spells, that's for sure. I have Shadowheart's AC boosted way up right now, because I put Raphael's armor on her, the Helldusk armor. And I also have the Amulet of Greater Health on her as well to give her Constitution 23. Try to help her hold concentration in this battle. But we'll see how it goes. Something tells me nothing is going to go as planned. Does it ever? Oh, 
Holy crap. I hope I wasn't supposed to go back and like get all of my allies to come with me. I'm hoping that they show up here. Otherwise, we got a real problem. Didn't mean to do that, but okay. Luckily, I have resistance to fire. Scratch almost died from that, though. Minsk's I'm going to use Cure Wounds on Scratch watches. with my Ranger. My Ranger always has a ton of spell slots. Minsk and Wolf do. We got plenty of spell slots. There you go, buddy. Don't waste a step. Ten F five, because it looks like we're coming up to an arena. Uh oh. The pain tells us what Goose knows is already known. The brain is near. Probably inside this brine right here. Hey, something's going on. Oh man, she's turning souls into mind flares. I think the elder brain. Deathly silence. The air is stale and putrid. It's close. Have the stones ready. Your blood slows. Your senses strung so tight they could snap in an instant. Oh man, a lot bigger than I thought. You think you know why you are here? You think that by killing the Chosen and taking the Netherstones, you can destroy me? You are wrong. going to do a strength check. Muster the full might of your physical form. Throw it into breaking through the brain's defenses. Number four says, bow before the glory of the nether brain, submit to domination. The unfortunate thing is, yeah, we had one strength check, which was nice, but now we're back to having basically no bonuses. 
with my low charisma and low dex character. So I'm going to go with wisdom because we do get a plus one. The first attempt is just that. Iteration is key. Aim for the crown and try again. 5% chance of getting a 20. I don't think it's even worth using inspiration. strong, you are mighty. You will dominate the brain. You have 30. That's so difficult. I think I... There's no way for me to even get it. I have to... I have to roll a nat 20. Let's try one more time. We have advantage, so... We have strength, dex, con, intelligence, wisdom, and charisma. Larian's giving everybody a chance to succeed here. This is probably going to be another 30 check. Maybe 99, it doesn't matter. Dominate the brain. 99, there it is. Oh, I got a... Oh man, I thought that was a 20 for a second. It was a 1. I'm going to use one more inspiration point, because this will be incredible if we actually got this. Come on, baby. Come on, kiss the dice. Oh! <laughs> so close. Absolutely terrifying. Baldurin. This is not over. Wow.
I was wondering when we would be back. This is the announcement trailer from 2019. This is what we were seeing and we had no idea. Just in time. The situation is worse than I thought. This is an Elder Brain. No longer. The magic of the crown has caused it to evolve. It has become something more. A nether brain. That's why it was so big. I thought the nether stones were supposed to allow us to dominate the brain. I thought so too. But that was when I believed it was still an elder brain. It has been anticipating our every move from the start. I underestimated it. We will need to rethink our plan. We tried to dominate the Elder Brain, but it has become too powerful to submit to orders. The Emperor might know what went wrong. Now keep in mind, we don't trust the Emperor right now. and He isn't too, uh, too keen on us either. I wonder if I can use Speak with the Dead on this Githyanki. my misty step amulet back on shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times okay we should be able to jump in here without taking too much damage where am i even going right now Nice. And there it is. That's where Orpheus is being kept. And as of right now, my character is leaning towards wanting to free Orpheus doing it in honor of Lazel's death. Looking ahead. 
but I'm also kind of unsure of what the right choice is. assessed our encounter with the netherbrake from every angle. I know why we failed. The problem was not the stones. The problem was you. You can make only one move at a time, but the netherbrain calculates every possible move at once. It knows what you will do. It knows everything you could possibly do. You cannot outmaneuver it. To defeat it, you would have to think like an anithid. Better yet, be one. Your mind is not capable of this. Mine is. You will give the stones to me. I will assimilate Orpheus, and then I will be able to leave this prison to face the brain. I don't believe a word you just said, Emperor. You still don't trust me. After all we've been through, remember, I have been your salvation from the very beginning. Your knight in shining armor. I freed you from the Nautiloid, prevented you from crashing to your death. I have protected you ever since, at no small cost to myself. I came to you as a leader, but I did not shy away from showing you vulnerability. I needed you as much as you needed me. I was not above recognizing this. When you discovered my true identity, I did not flinch from the truth. I never lied to you, not once. I am just like you. We have the same enemy, the same story. I encouraged you to fulfill your potential, all while protecting you from harm. Now I ask you for the last time to trust me. Release the Nether Stones to me. Do not forget, there's a card yet to come into play. The Orb. If we do not want to surrender the stones, but still use it to ensure the brain's destruction. Along with my own, of course. This is a risk we cannot take. Your hubris drives you even now. You failed before. I cannot trust that you will not fail again. You must trust me. Hand me the stones. I will never trust you. I told you we had one solution. You rejected it. I told you I sought only one thing. Freedom. You have denied me this. You have exhausted our alliance, and in so doing, you have ruined us all. I did everything I could to avoid this, but it seems you have whittled my options down to a single one. In order to survive, I must now join the Netherbrain. Wow. The hammer. We can free Orpheus. I hope he is not angry about the eons of imprisonment. I have been a statue. It is not so bad. Hope so too, Minsk. I hope so too. The Orphic Hammer.
the Githyanki prince takes his blade, a silent cry pierces your head. It's unlike any sensation you've ever felt. You reek of Illithid. You stole an unborn hatchling from my people. Oh, that was an accident. And you slaughtered my honor guard. Bro. Nonetheless, it seems we must be allies. You may address me as your majesty. Your honor guard attacked me. What was I supposed to do? You should have yielded to them. They would have given you a noble end. Any worthy individual destined to become geek would have done so. My guard would have freed me, and I would have stopped the Elder Brain before it evolved into a Nether Brain. All that suffering... Avoidable. Were it not for the choices you made. While we bicker, the Nether Brain is executing the grand design. We need to stop it. In this, we are aligned. I am obliged to overlook your transgressions. We will destroy the Nether Brain together and put a stop to this nascent empire before it expands into the stars. The Geek was correct about one thing. The Netherbrain's power is beyond us. The hardest metal in the world would not cut through its mind, for it is made of thought itself. At this point, it will take an Elithid to unleash the full potential of the Netherstones. And it would take one wizard to unleash a cataclysm powerful enough to tear apart the brain's very being. We have no choice but to consider using the orb. I do not know you, wizard. And I do not know this orb. But what I do know is that we must not gamble with the fate of the world. I cannot simply depend upon your word. This isn't an easy decision. I need a moment to consider it. Consider, yes. But know that the answer is already foretold. This is the only way to stop the grand design. Whatever prevents you from doing what is necessary, face it. Overcome it. Return to me when you are ready to transform. Oh, now the Githyanki is asking me to become an Elithid. What has the world become? Woken from his slumber, and already the Prince of the Githyanki demands one of us surrender our souls in service of him. No doubt, in the context of eons of torture, it seems a small ask. But, of course, he does not realize what else we might have to offer. The thought must have crossed your mind, and has certainly weighed on mine. I think it's time we reconsider the orb. With its power, I could put an end to this whole thing. Crown, nether brain, absolute. Everything. You would rather end your own life than trust the Emperor with the stones? In a word? Yes. The real question is... Do you trust me? Do not mistake me, I want to live. Well, I've been careless enough in my life in the past. I can hardly stand by and watch you sacrifice yours. Once I'm in position, I'll ensure you are removed to a safe vantage point to watch the fireworks. <laughs> you need not die alongside me. Nor surrender your soul in becoming an illithid. So become an illithid or let Gal become a suicide bomber. Are you kidding me right now? Absolutely not. We came this far together, Gal. We're going to survive together, too. I like the sound of that. Very well. We'll do this the old-fashioned way, then. Swords, spells, and sweat. Adventurous to the end. Whatever form it may take. Oh. Right, let's talk to Shadow, see if she has anything to say. There I 
was thinking we were finally about to put an end to all of this. Too good to be true, I suppose. Do you think we can win this? I do. Think of all we've been through just to get to this moment. That wasn't luck. That was us. Let's just stay shoulder to shoulder and see this through. Minsk. Onward then. If you are so set on taking the form of a fish, then Minsk and Boo will keep you from the Netherbrain's hook. Okay. Quickly now. Even here, we do not have infinite time. I trust you have weighed your options and reached the only honorable conclusion. Are you ready to transform? I don't think I am, to be quite honest with you. Prince of the Githyanki wants me to transform. The Emperor wants me to transform. I don't know if it's the right call. I will never be a Mind Flayer, Orpheus. Just as I was free. I will do it. I will become illithid. I will sacrifice my soul for my people. I will end the grand design. Oh my god, that changes things. If he's willing to sacrifice himself, that that means... That means that that's probably the right play. One of us has to become a Mind Flayer. I still don't know if I completely trust him or the Emperor. I'm gonna go with number one. You are a true hero, Orpheus. The Nether Brain will be only too pleased to claim me. Even in my darkest hours, I knew it was my destiny to save my people. I could never have imagined this would be the way. Give Kartavkeen crushed. Wow. That would have been us. the nether brain and finish this once the grand design is ended kill me it is the very least you can do this is crazy Come. it's time for us to meet up i kind of feel bad that i let him change right now but at the same time there's too many unknowns that my character is unaware of. Let's get going. Orpheus and the Emperor seem to know a lot more than I do, so let's hope that he made the right decision doing that. I think we're done here. I'll certainly be glad to see the back of it anyway. We have a city to save. I think it's about time we got started. Back to the city. Who thinks it is time for a second bite of this brain? My adventuring party works best when none of us are space octopuses. I've got a long road ahead. All right, portal to High Hall. That's in the upper city.
Let's go. Wow. Okay, so we're at High Hall right now, which is the city's main government building. Clearly, it's not doing too well right now. Another brain has made its way to the High Hall. We're going to have to fight or sneak our way through to reach it. Okay, we're not there yet. This is where the brain came out of the ground, I think, and just tore the city apart. This is crazy. What an ending. And yet it is. Orpheus took this form so we could defeat the Netherbrain. Orpheus. My prince. What's become of you? The grand design must be ended. A sacrifice had to be made. The duty fell to me. I am not long for this world. Or any other. What of Vlakith? What of our liberty? You underestimate your own people. Their imaginations have kept the name Orpheus alive for millennia. Bring them my message. Tell them my fate. Some will doubt. Some will mock. But some will listen. And the spark will be lit. Get Yankee freedom means nothing if the grand design comes to pass. We need your help, Voss. Find your nerve, my friend. Today, we strike at the brain. This champion holds the key to the grand design's end. Answer to him as you would to me. Your majesty. I have spoken. As you wish. I stand at the ready. Your friendship. Your constancy. When I fell to despair, they elated me. Thank you, my friend. Shabazai. Shabazai. Now, to the Netherbrain. Let it be the first victim in the war for the skies. Your allies have pledged to help you. You can summon them during combat with that icon button. Okay, where would that be? On my hotbar. Oh, it's right there. Call forth allies. And Orpheus turned out to be quite the incredible character. And what an important figure in the lore of this world. Absolute war zone. It looks like War of the Worlds right now. Nautiloid ships flying around everywhere. Nautiloid ships haven't been seen for thousands of years. We have lost much already. And we will lose more before the day is out. But even when the last soul falls, Baldur's Gate will stand. For Baldur's Gate is more than just a city. It is more than a place of opportunity for those of mercantile spirit. More than a place of refuge for those who are lost. More than a home for friends, loved ones, and adventuring soul. Baldur's Gate is a place where anyone can find what they need, if they're just willing to fight for it. Today, Baldur's Gate needs us. Today, we fight for...
Your late friend? This is the one you spoke of. The very same. The one who comes to save the city. They will lay the final stitch on the fate of Baldur's Gate. The Fist examines your illithid ally with suspicion. He was not expecting the savior of Baldur's Gate to be accompanied by a mind flare. Appearances may change, but they do not mask the one within. This one, I know. Observe with whom it traveleth. Friends, this mind flare will fight with thee. It will save thy city and thy lives. The fist eyes your lithid ally with suspicion, softening to curiosity. His hostility melting at the recognition that there's more behind those eyes than malice. My steel is yours, and I'm not alone. <laughs> Whatever strength I have to lend, I will lend it. I will make my city proud again. I'm in the mood to crack some skulls after that fuckery in the Temple of Baal. <laughs> the City Watch will be glad to oblige me. Not sure what I have to offer a mind flare, if I'm honest. But I hope my words of encouragement and reassurance will strengthen your resolve. I want my city back. And I've brought the toughest bastards from the guild to get the job done. My people have never hunted a monster this large. They are eager to join the fray. Nature's servant awaits. Glad to have you with us. And not a moment too soon. The air is thick with anticipation. All eyes are on you. They're expecting a speech. Something to stir their hearts and put fire in their bellies for the fight ahead. Embrace your courage, allies, and let it guide you through battle. Do not give in to fear. Hell of a speech right there. Well said. We'll prepare ourselves. We'll be ready when you call upon us. Baldurin's grace be with you. Not as bad as it could have. Wow, look at this. This is incredible. This is so epic right now. Everybody coming together at the end. Of course, I have to talk to a few of these characters. Have courage, my friend. Your victory is assured. Don't look at me. This is your charge to lead. And no one better to do it. Wish I could have Jahira in my group. I mean, I could have, but... Armored Owlbear. <laughs> everybody's running from Fern still. The end of the world and everybody's scared of my animal companions. <laughs> Jeez, Lulu's gonna toss herself off a cliff. All right. I don't think we have to care as much about loot anymore. It is time to defeat the Elder Brain. Not sure which way I'm supposed to go. I think I'm supposed to go this way. To battle! feel like looting because I want gold. <laughs> Let's try to speak with dead real fast. Oh, it doesn't let me.
Is this how the City Watch valiantly defends its home? Mind flare. Mind flare. It's over. There's a glimmer of something beyond his words. But in a moment, it's gone, consumed with fear. Scared they are. One last run, then we're clear. Did you see where the nether brain went? I get to the brain from here. Must go up, but courtyard heavily guarded will not make it that way. Is there another way to reach the brain? Enemies came from mountainside. Not sure. What forces await in the courtyard? Illithids and others. Many, too many. How many illithids are there? Enough to keep survivors and rescuers. The spells, pal. Restoration pod right here. This is so cool. Go, baby. Keep it light with a few cantrips. Wow, look at Orpheus's hot bar right here. Concentrated blast, extract brain, force tunnel, black hole, airless stakes, stage fright. There's so many. And Karsus's compulsion. Channel the stone's magic to control the crown of Karsus. And dominate the nether brain. Take care of this one first. Nice and easy. If we have restoration pods around here, I can use some spell slots. 
Enough movement, really. Dice roll in my favor. Oh, we got one back here, too. Damn it. Larian has a plan for these flying creatures now, apparently. Now I'm in a tough position. Butt kicking. But kicking for goodness. Okay. Unleash me. Oh! Wow, critical hit on Gale to start. Yeah. Even the hells are here. Just make it to that one to help out Gale. We'll use Minsk to go there. Actually, Minsk has good AoE, so... Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Shot off. Well, I blew up our ladder we needed. <laughs> oh man, okay. All right. Well, fair enough. There's no saves coming on this run. All right, let's see what this guy has here. Tentacle whip, eight to 35 damage. It's a melee attack. Levitate, float effort effortlessly to a destination. Blast a creature with a sapping psychic energy. If the target was concentrating on the spell, you heal equal to the damage dealt. Extract brain. 10 foot radius. Mind Blast has a 47 foot range. We'll do that. The target is blocked. Really? Blocked by what? Damn. That was crazy. Oh, looks like we can go down here, too. Send Wolf across. Where is, uh, Fern? Okay, Fern's back here. And Scratch, too. Come on, doggies. been nice to get up there not gonna lie i can get up a few companions i wonder if i have i have misty step really don't want to go back down i have misty step with wolf and gale let's think about this for a second i'm back
I have a potion of flying. Okay, I can do this, actually. The animals, on the other hand, aren't going to be able to come up. So let's go ahead and start off, separate everybody. We're going to go up with Gale first. Okay, we'll put him right there. Could also stack some boxes, too. Oh, you know what I have? I have Dimension Door. I can't afford to fail. Shadowheart has Fly. Oh, then we can just do this without, without it. Get up there, Minsk. is cool. And then all we have left is Wolf. And Mr. Orpheus. Oh, he's coming right up. Perfect. Okay. And then I can actually... Figured out. And the crew is back. Let's make a manual save point here. I was trying to make a save point. But then a mind flare came up. Alright, well here we go. Everybody's calling for help. It'll take a while to really understand all of these abilities. Man, they look really cool. Extract brain. Might pull Fern into it. We'll leave Scratch back here. Get a Minsk. Whoa, vision cones. That was close. No doubt there'll be others. Come back here, Minsk. Let's 
does this walk okay, we're still looking pretty good. And sleeps in my boot. Got most of our spell slots. What incredible architecture. Such great attention to detail. Oop, I'm pickpocketing the mind flare. It's probably not a good idea. <laughs> We have an ogre right there. Goblin trackers. Oh We're going to stay to the left and see if we can kill these guys real fast. Oh, these guys are in combat with whoever's inside here. to the kitchen staff. It's going to take many years for Baldur's Gate to recover from this. If you're this. going to do it, just make it quick and painless. I am not here to kill you. You're not? But the mind flare. Don't look at it like that. That's the mind flare that's going to save the city. Um, sure. Low key, that gnome was pretty hot. Yeah, I think we have to go and s through that door right there. Yeah, we can't come down here. All right, back into sneak mode. Supreme Elixir of Arcane Cultivation. We got my oh my god. Well, there goes our mission of stealth. It's only Shadowheart that's actually in combat right now. Let's see how many people she's in combat with. So two intellect of ours and one mind flare. Honestly, not too bad. I'm gonna bring her back into this room. And wow, how am I not in combat with these guys? What if I can jump over this side right here? Yes, I can. Okay. Wolf just walks right through it like a badass. Okay, and Gal is also in combat. Everybody's in combat. Seventy-one HP. That's not too bad. Take this guy down pretty fast. He's gonna use cantrips. Yeah, he's definitely dead now. Time to push my luck again. See ya. And then we just have to deal with two little brains, which are coming up this way.
epic music. And one more little brain. He's all the way down there. I think we're going to let him come to us. Yeah, we'll do that. A brave little brain. He is. I respect it. Oh my god, I just noticed there is a spectator. <laughs> I just noticed it, because from this angle you can only see its backside, which kind of camouflages, but when you scroll around to the front, you can't miss that eye, that's for sure. Okay, and we also have a bunch of goblins below it. Some nautiloid tanks too. Okay. Let's go ahead and make sure that Orpheus is sneaking. Scratch is sneaking. I'm going to leave Scratch up here, actually. He's our revive dog. He does have the help action. And Minsk, actually, I'm going to send you with this crew. I'm sending in a strike force. was so in after I jumped I couldn't tell if I was in stealth or if I wasn't oh it would have been so epic to come up behind that spectator and whack him with mint scan boo we would have taken him down in like second round of combat you leave me no choice we must attack Okay, the spectator needs to go down first, so we're going to start off with... A little bit too far. Hold on, if we can get Gal up here... Or we can Misty Step Gal. Can we get up here? I don't think we can get up there. Not enough movement. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Can't afford to let up. All right, in shadow. Before we do any concentration spells or anything, let's see if we can get a guiding bolt off. The guiding bolt level three. Spiritual weapon. We'll back up a little bit. That takes care of the spectator. I don't think I want... We gotta make sure that Orpheus doesn't die. But I shouldn't send him up necessarily. leave him right there. Still have a bonus action, and all of these are bonus actions. It's crazy. Oh man, I could do that, though. Charge forward, pushing all objects and creatures in your path 40 feet away from you. If I did that, would it push all of these guys that way? I think it would. We also have to watch out for the Nautiloid tank, though.
pretty good. I'll go right down there. Scratch, you're staying up here. Minsk, take care of these goblins. Great job. Tadpole powers are so cool. I can't wait to embrace the illithid in me on my other one. <laughs> Boo, just one shot a goblin. I love my miniature giant space hamster. All right, gal, let's see what we can get you to do, my man. We got the Mind Flare right there. I think these are the only combatants down here, so let's go ahead and Misty Step. We got this guy up here. Misty Step to over here. Let's drop a Cloud of Daggers. It's been a while since we've used that. Great job. We'll go behind the wagon. Wish I still had fly active. Channel teleport though. Let's go. Perfect. Everybody's doing pretty good health wise. When did I get the reflective shell? Did I miss something? Why is that power available to Shadowheart right now? I haven't used... I haven't consumed any tadpoles. I do want to call in my allies, but I'm afraid that we only get to do it one time. And this combat encounter doesn't seem like it's too bad, so... I want to extract brain here. Can't do it on a mind flayer. I want to see what that does. Seems like Concentrated Blast is the way to go, though. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> Don't know what's going on, but there's a lot of people in this combat encounter now. Okay, they leave me no choice. I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to do something that you guys never thought I would ever do. No, I thought it was going to work. I saved the ogre horn for the end of the game. There's no ogres around here, though. <laughs> Fair enough, Larian. Fair enough. That takes care of that guy. Absolute cultists. The Inquisitor of the Absolute. Oh, 
Oh, damn. I think it's time for Spirit Guardians. What do y'all think? Arrow of Arcane Interference. 6 to 15 damage. It's really not that much. We'll do a level 1 shield. Alright, so Cloud of Daggers is pretty much good now. Let's go ahead and pick our next target. I think we're going to help out with these Winged Horrors. Or I could just one-shot one of these Inquisitors of the Absolute with a Disintegrate. That would be pretty cool, and that would also be pretty epic. Maybe I'll save it for the Mind Flare. That'd be a risky, misty step. I'm going to hold off with Gal. We're going to save our power play for next round. I'm going to create undead after this fight. Mirror image first. You know, we probably could have snuck in through the double iron doors. If I wasn't spotted, we probably could have avoided all of this black hole. But hey, I don't mind some good combat, right? If you wish, Minsk will not judge. Become absolute. Didn't expect that voice from the line player. Go ahead and cancel this cloud of daggers. It's hard to see over there. Where are these guys coming from? This is crazy. When things start looking fishy, I'll call my allies. guys are grouped up for a nice fireball. There's no description here. Hold on. I'm gonna... Let me hit F5. I'm gonna click on this call forth allies and see if it just lets you choose or something. It does. We can call in the Gur, Hunt Wardens, Silver Harp Squadron, Guildmaster Keen, The Watch, and also Kithraki Inferno. Command the Red Dragon of Supreme Kithrak Voss to breathe a wall of fire onto the battlefield. Dismissed after combat until resummoned. Can't be resummoned again if killed in combat. Okay. Let's go ahead and call in. Let's call in the Watch, because the Watch are the city's guard force for the upper city. So they would be fighting for their territory, actually. We'll see what that does. Nice. 
Nice, nice, nice. Okay, let's go Spirit Guardians and hope to God we don't lose our concentration. I do have a really high constitution. And I have Warcaster too, so... Honestly, I seriously might move Shadow up here by herself, front line. That's how good Spirit Guardians is. See that? Tell me Cleric's not the best class in the game. Incubating. Oh no, not this again. That reminds me of... Bone Chill? We're gonna let that one go. Reminds me of the Merkle Avatar fight. Back in Act 2 at Moonrise Towers. Paralyzed. Okay. Can't get the black hole off. Oh, I can. A lot of damage. Guardian of Faith, really? Okay, well, we better get away from that. Smack a Mind Flare. Gotta stay away from that guardian. Still got a little goblin right here. Okay, so Shadow Hearts got this guy. Shadow Hearts definitely got these two as well. I'm gonna hold my ground. I didn't think that was going into the radius. Doesn't look like it is. Okay, well in that case, we'll just come down. Here. There are ogres in the vicinity, just not the ogres that work with my horn. You're wondering, don't save the ogre horn for the end of the game. Hanja Barrage, ranged weapon. Not today, my friend. Not today. Let's see if we can keep these. I want to try to keep these watch guardians alive. Because the elder brain fight's probably going to be crazy. Watch Guardians are going to get destroyed by the Guardian of Faith, though. Nice. They took it like champs. They're even wearing blue, too. Larian staying very accurate to the lore. I appreciate it. Sometimes you gotta go for the plays with Gale. You know what I'm saying? This is my high ground. Get through here without taking an opportunity attack. It doesn't look like I can. I go here. That's 20 feet, 19 feet. I don't think I can pull it. I'm just going to go straight in between them both. 
Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Fireball? Yeah, we're gonna counter that. Absolutely. Wow. Just kind of learning these mind flayer powers for the first time. That was awesome. That was basically counter spell, the mind flayer version. Oh, I wish I blew up those barrels. Okay, we got one more mind flayer back there. Scratch, you're being a good boy. You stay right back there. Must help out Shadow Heart. Oh, I forgot about this. Look at this. So topple the big folk. 20 to 35 damage. Deal additional damage equal to your proficiency bonus. On a hit, large, huge, or gargantuan creatures take an additional 2 to 12 slashing damage. And they may also fall prone. And this is the sword that I have. Alderan's Giant Slayer. Nice. Powerful. Very powerful. Spiritual weapon's not doing too much, is it? The reach that Hellbirds have is crazy. How's my guard doing here? They're doing pretty good. One's got 8 HP though. I'm a little bit worried about him. He also misses a lot too. Okay, 22 HP and 27. So close. Three HP left. And we're almost done with this battle. Oh, I can't get out of this guy's reach. Go help out over here. Oh, let me do it. Why not? There we go. Oh, no. Nice.
do we got left? Two soldiers. I think just two. Oh, the adept is up here too. Choice but to keep going. Kill this guy first. Let's get this over with. Actually, completely out of spell slots with Gale. a healing ability too. And that's a wrap. Wow. Get everybody together. Come on, Scratch. Good boy. He said I'm not too worried about loot right now. Let's see if we can go get that. Actually, I don't want to get into another combat encounter, though. Hold on. Doesn't seem like anybody's here. Let's go get this restoration pod. There we go, we have all of our spell slots back. Oh, do I not have eight active right now? Must have lost it, let's see. Rallied, we need to do mage armor too. I guess I didn't do my pre-casting. Unless I did in the restoration pod, resets you. Where's little Boo? Did Boo die in that battle? Always give Boo long strider. Always. Okay. I guess we're going through those double iron doors now. Well, let's go ahead and F5. Let's see what challenges await us. The High Hall Courtyard. There we go. This happens. Nautiloid. Need to get to the brain. Now. Nice. 
Something's going on. I'm not exactly sure what it is, what it is but... Orphic Favor. While within 60 feet of Prince Orpheus, the affected entity has resistance to psychic damage and plus three bonus to intelligence, wisdom, and charisma saving throws. We're also rallied from Duke Ravenguard. We'll get him, boo. Actually, oh damn, murderous cloud of daggers. You will bleed for her glory. Black Gauntlet of Bane. The dragons will burn them to ash. Damn, I wish I countered that. I don't know if I can get through this. Might be able to. Nice. Nope, I got hit. I think we gotta make our charge. I know you can't jump through the cloud of daggers, but we're just gonna run through it. What's going on in the combat log? Holy crap. I think it's been doing that most of most of the time. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so that's what that is. Mind Flayer Reinforcements. Intellect Gluttons? Oh, this is bad. This is real bad. Oh, well that works out pretty good. Alright, we got slow on three targets. I mean, wouldn't he just be able to... I don't think I have to do it with both. Just in case. Stay here and we'll be swarmed. Must keep going. Find a way through. Yeah, you're right, man. Hmm. You know what this call is for. I'll tell you right now. I don't even know where we're gonna go here. The statue looks like it will break though. This calls for potion of speed. I actually didn't think that one through because I need my bonus action for what I was about to do. This will work too. Worked very well.
Trying to figure out how I'm gonna get up there. Hmm. Wonder which way this statue would fall. Hot kicking for goodness. You have dimension door. Alright, Wolf. Any way you can jump up there. Doesn't look like it. Another step forward. Next turn, we're gonna Misty step up. Six HP. Oh my God. <gasps> that was incredible. Oh, damn, there's more intellect of ours behind us again. I'm assuming there's going to be a restoration pod or something up here. Perfect. Oh, really? The statue's in my way? Hmm. Path is interrupted because the intellect of hour is too short. I can't do anything over here. <laughs> I have no movement left. Okay, at least we're out of the danger zone. I could fireball, actually. Let's do it. Why not? Don't even need it. Displacer or beast shape? Let's do that. This is gonna be cool. Nice. That's awesome. 
You have displaced. Teleport yourself and a target near to a nearby location, shredding the target's mind and leaving behind an illusory copy of yourself. Nothing. Not even one hit. That she's about to come down, though. Oh, damn. The mind player got hit. How many turns does this thing get? This is starting to get pretty crazy. No end to them. This is futile. We need to move. All right, we really gotta just—I don't know—we really gotta just go for the doors up here. I think it's clear that it's never gonna end. Still alive. Wow, that's impressive. Everybody's up now. Let's go ahead and do Spirit Guardians. Oh, no, 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 no. Crap. I'm in the kill zone here with Minsk. There's no way off it now. Minsk is going to take some damage. Let's just say that much. Unless I have a potion of flying, which I do. But I don't have a bonus action. That doesn't help. Alright, Minsk. Maybe go right here. Right, he might be safe right there, actually. Yeah, right up there with Wolf. Right up there. Perfect. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, I tried to get him to be inside the circle. That's so badass. Okay, here we go. Oh 
no. There's nowhere to go. Look at that movement speed right there. Incredible. Well, we made it to the door. Spiritual weapon, you're gonna die. Hate to tell ya. Gale might be in trouble too, actually. Swarm AI was such a nice improvement to the game. Oh my god, dude. This is... This is crazy. Can't get him to safety. Might have to go over here with Gale. You're gonna fire next round. There it is, the restoration pod. Why can't I get through here? There we go. You only have to send one player ahead, and that'll disable the ship. Kind of feels like Game of Thrones right now, doesn't it? Are you ready to face the nether brain? I think I'm as ready as I'll ever be. So let's go for it. We're gonna call in, we're gonna call in the bear for this. Uh oh, did that bug out? I think it bugged out. And let's go ahead and... I don't know if it's actually worth using a... Higher level spell slot to create the zombie. Or the mummy. But I will do animate dead. Hmm. Let's do flying ghouls. Perfect. Right away. There we go. And we also need Boo. Apparently Boo got murdered by the Nautiloid ship.
brain. It's high above the city now, far away from any innocence. I can end this now. Stop the absolute and spare the city. The stage is set for my final act. Mistress bidding and the redemption that lies beyond. You brought me right where I need to be. I have no right to ask more of you. It's time I spirited you to safety. This is a fate I must face alone. Orpheus has already transformed into a mind flare. True, but it's not too late to reconsider. This would all be over in mere moments if I ascend alone. It's now or never. No, Gale. We can ascend together and put an end to this. Should it look like we'll fail, that's your moment. You'd be dying in vain. I don't need company to sacrifice myself. Please. For too long, I've lived in fear of taking a host of innocents with me when I expired. Now at least I can be assured my demise will be saving them instead. We're going to end this together and live to tell the tale. If you're mistaken, this could be the end of everything. We'll be failing right at the last hurdle. But I only made it this far thanks to you. A minor question such sterling guidance now. Mistra won't be pleased. But perhaps trying to please the gods is a fool's errand. Lead on then. So stay my hand as long as I can. But if the tide of battle turns against us, remember I have the means to bring a swift end to this. That red dragon has weird colored eyes. There it is. The crown of Carsus. The site of power. The site of domination. Place where the nether stones can enforce control. The Emperor. Top the nether brain. This might be one of the most badass battlegrounds I've ever seen in a video game to date. A mind flare is up here on the second shelf. Infected entity sheds light in a 10 foot radius, has resistance to cold damage, and deals 2 to 16 fire damage to anyone who hits it with a melee attack. And we have the crown. Dominated red dragon. 400 HP. Being dominated by the nether brain. Fire damage is nullified. 
about the Emperor? Astral Gravity, Triple Jump Distance, and Volatile Shield. Grant to temporary hit points by an Illithid. If these are removed by incoming damage, the shield bursts. Possibly stunning nearby foes. These guys don't seem like they have too much. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to go after the Emperor first. And we will send... Let's send little Boo over here off to the side. Pull a little bit of... Oh my god. Uh-oh. Okay. Take my flying ghoul. Let's see if we can make it to the Emperor. Send up our pawns first. Every time you step on the Elder Brain, a tentacle sprouts up? Seriously? Um... Hmm, okay. Where's Wolf? Let me send Wolf up. He has fire resistance and we're facing a red dragon. I guess I can't. Not a good start. That's for sure. I don't know if I should... I, I, I don't think I can stay back. I think I have to go for it. No! I'm not going to be able to make it there. Okay, so on this turn, let's just take a melee shot. Or a range shot, excuse me. Got rid of his shield. Damn, two critical hits. To send Orpheus up right now. <laughs> Should I do it? I think I'm going to. Curriculum of strategy. Damn. 29 HP. The Emperor has left right now. That's crazy. Right, I'm gonna back up with Gale. And call forth allies too. Shadowheart, what do we want to do with you, my friends? I might actually do Bless right now. Or I could just jump down there with Spirit Guardians and let it do work. Think for a second. I don't have... Oh, I do have Bless. I'm gonna do it. Start off with that. Scratch, you stay back here, buddy. We're so close right now. Emperor's almost dead on the first round right here. Nice. One more of those. Come on, Wolf. You can do it. The Emperor has been defeated. I think. I'm nervous about jumping down there because of the tentacles. Look, I gotta get back on these mind flares as fast as possible. Oh, look at this.
Okay. I'm going to take the opportunity attack. Yes. Psionic suggestion. The wisdom save. Right again. Nice. Everybody's targeting Gal right now. Red Dragon's turn is coming up. That's not good. Oh my god, are you serious? Mind Flayers are shooting Curriculum of Strategies. Orpheus has 40 HP right now. That's not good. All right, let's hit F5. Orpheus is out of his displacer form. Currently has about half HP. I think I'm going to go back into displacer beast form. Did I use that wrong? I must have. Honestly, I don't know what to do right now. I am going to send Gal up this way. Problem is, we still have a dragon right now. <laughs> oh man, okay. So I put Minsk on the dragon. Oh, you know what I think I have? Hold on, let's take a look real fast. I swear to God, I have... Oh, man. Hold on. Arrow of Aberration Slain. Arrow of Dragon Slain. Send that to Minsk. 50% chance, really? Even with Bless? Okay. Let's go ahead and do Hunter's Mark. Let's give it a try. Oh, it really wasn't that good. I thought I was gonna like do massive damage. He is bleeding, so that's good, I guess. I wonder if Guardian of Faith would be good. Probably not. You know what? I think I'm going to move Shadowheart over this way, too. I 
I don't like being down here. We're going to start moving up this way. On the move. Scratch is still hidden, so perfect. Alright, Wolf, are you the Dragon Slayer or what are you? What are we gonna do with you? Who am I Hunter's Mark focusing on right now? Minsk has the Hunter's Mark on the Dragon. Don't have potions of speed. Go get it. Massive damage. Massive damage. I'm also going to do topple the big folk. Invalid target. Oh, you can't use it on a dragon? Unfortunate. Nautilite is on the way. It will appear soon. Three turns remaining. I literally just noticed that. Oh, great. Character just dropped his weapon. Are you okay, my man? Magic missile on six targets. Aha. Damn, look at these mind flares. Just, this is crazy. And look at the city. This is such an epic ending. It's crazy. There's the Sea Tower of Baldur in. Can we see Sorcerer Sundries from up here? Somewhere over here. Or somewhere over here. Okay, Orpheus is about to die. I gotta do something about that. No, no, no! I mean target is blocked. That should work. <laughs> oh, come on, man. All right, I guess I'm never going to do it again on any creatures that can fly or levitate. It was working in Act 2. Well, that sucks. Okay. I got to get our buddy Orpheus up here. Okay, nice. 47 HP. I'm about to throw another one. Screw it. It sounds strategy, I'm sure. And then we'll get up and... Hmm. This guy's almost dead. We'll get up in his face.
Wow, I can make it all the way up there. A little bit nervous right now, though. He's really low HP. Go over here. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Nice. Okay, we got Orpheus to safety. Kinda. to the crown okay all right wolf i'm gonna put you right on the dragon once again my man you do that for me phase optimizer i don't want that oh my weapon Oh, damn, my weapon's on the ground over there. No. No. Got to put on the Sword of Chaos now. Why the heck did she do that? <laughs> what are they doing? Ooh, I almost got shoved off right there. their own i think where are these oh my god there's like eight more people in the order of turns now okay wolf has 24 hp We have to get Orpheus close to that. Oh my god, yes. That was incredible. That was Disintegrate, for those of you guys wondering what spell that was. Alright, channel the stone's magic to control the crown of Karsis. Looks so cool. Okay, so affected entity is focusing all their magic and effort on casting Karsis's 
compulsion until their next turn. Come incapacitated, stun, polymorph, or knockdown ends the spell. Okay, so we gotta protect the Mind Flayer, I guess, now. I don't know if I want to go all out on the dragon or if I want to start moving my entire team up to the top. Don't quite know what to do at the moment. I can call in allies. Um, you know what? Maybe I will right now. Let's... Well, you need an action to do that. Because... Yeah, you're not coming back, are you? Nope, you're not. Need my weapon back. Well, I wonder if I could cast Sanctuary on... I'm not sure if I can. Scratch, you just stay right there, my man. You're our resurrect dog. I need you. You can take me on. Oh man, we can't be having that, my man. There you go. actually kind of nice. I have both of my strength-based rangers on the front line here. Taking on the dragon. Everybody else has taken the high ground. Okay. Okay. I like how it kills the tentacles. Attack. Don't attack Orpheus. Oh no. Okay, we gotta do something here. This is getting getting out of hand here. Can't get them both in it. So close. So close. Honestly, might use Blink. Let's call forth allies. Let's call in. Oh, we can do a wall of fire. The Kithraki Inferno. The watch. We can get Harpers. Or the Gur Hunt Warden. So we'll do that. They like to hunt mind flares. Perfect. Perfect placement. I don't know if I did that or what. Okay. This dragon still got 308 HP. That's insane. Doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Should 
chip away at it slowly, right? I don't think she survived. I might try casting Sanctuary on Orpheus. Do I have it prepared? I don't even know what it looks like. I do. Got to get a little bit closer. Okay, let's do a let's do a guiding bolt. Help out our rangers a little bit. Damn, I'm running super low on HP again. Incinerated one of the mind flares. Oh, the dragon's right in the Nautiloid circle right now. No, Harper. Still blown away by the visuals. Like, this is a CRPG. How insane is this? Okay, whose turn is it? It's Gal's turn, so... Maybe we'll help out with the dragon? We have one Mind Flayer left up here. I should haste Wolf, but I don't- I can't get down there. Hmm. Okay, we'll take care of the immediate threat. What if I telekinesis this guy? All the way down here. I don't think that would really do much. It would be funny though. Didn't even know that it had shield. Okay, do I try this again? I think I'm going to. We can just survive until Shadowheart's turn. Okay, Minsk has pretty good HP. Let's see if we can get down there. A little bit worried about the tentacles, though. Sometimes you gotta just go for it. We call in some watch members here. Actually, I don't know if that's a good idea. Oh, we have a mind flare down here.
Okay, let's move up to here and let's do sanctuary. Oh my god, I think it worked. I think it worked. Affected entity can't be targeted by enemy attacks or spells. However, it can still take damage from AoE spells. And Sanctuary is only a bonus action? That's crazy. Can't go through this. Kind of trapped back here. Hmm. What to do? What to do? What to do? Still concentrating on Bless. Is good. Okay. I don't think there's anything I can do on this turn right now. Besides Sanctuary. guy's spazzing out. Holy cow. Oh my god. Look at him. Oh, please don't break on me. This encounter, I feel like it's going pretty good right now. Okay, thank god. Get over there, wolf. You dragon slayer. I mean, not enough resources. And I... Oh, I'm not close enough. Really? <laughs> I'm not close enough to the dragon right now? Are you kidding me? There's buttholes on top of my head. Trying to face the Mind Flayer attacks. I want him aiming this way. Perfect. So now if he does that psionic blast, it's not going to hit Orpheus over here. At least I don't think it will. No! No! Wow, that was close. I think Orpheus is fine. He is. Can you believe it? From the Druid's Grove to the top of an Elder Brain over a burning city. Oh, hopefully Orpheus doesn't get hit by that. did it the brain is weakened this is our chance will not submit. even bound its will is stronger than anything you've ever felt the chains shake threatening to break at any moment it's vulnerable but not defeated use the portal we will bring it down together. Absolute freedom. Its will is weakening. The brain is almost defeated. Wow. Wow, is it okay, everybody's gotta come through the portal now? This might be the most epic thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I have nightmares from this. 
Chains of Karsus. Netherman is too powerful for even the momentary god's magic. Karsus' compulsion could not dominate it completely. The spell has instead bound the brain's will in place. To complete the domination, you must strike it down. Okay. Whatever you say. I guess I'm going to try... I'm not close enough for that. Just don't know all of these abilities. Can I extract the brain with the elder brain? Okay, that was a mistake. Honestly, I could just leave the... I think I could just leave the dragon. Um, I would take one opportunity attack. Make it almost all the way there. Oh, nice. Get in there, wolf. Might have to call in some more allies. What do we got left? We got Silver Harp Squadron. And the Wall of Fire. These guys are ranged combat. Let's summon them in over here. Perfect. We got some archers on the high ground. I like it. Go on in, Shadow. Go in. You mean not enough movement? Oh, there we go. Yeah, we probably want to spread out here, I'm assuming. how much of work it might it would have taken to design this encounter imagine how much work it took to design this encounter okay it's okay it's okay nice this is it its will is weakening. I wonder if you can blind. <laughs> blind it. I don't think I did anything. Well, it's okay. I had. It's fine. Okay, can I get into the portal with my bear? I don't think I can. Okay. Looks like my bear's got to stay out here. Bear necessities. Oh, is the dragon completely out of the nether brain's control right now? I'm not sure. No, okay. Just killing everything.
marked for negation. That doesn't sound good. What the heck is that? The affected entity is within range of the nether brain's orb of negation. The orb will explode on its turn, dealing two, 20 to 200 force damage. Yeah, we're going to probably get away from that. Here we go, our first damage. Epic. Shall be done. Whoa. No, don't do that to me right now. Oh, thank God. Right, let's hit F5 again. All right, Minsk, head on in, man. We're going to let the Harpers handle handle the dragon and the Nautiloid ships. They'll be all right. Don't worry about it. They will be A-OK. -okay. Why is that showing death? I'm throwing a smoke powder bomb. How... How could I die? <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. Alright, Shadow, I think I want... I wonder if a Guardian of Faith would be... Doing a lot of testing. When I probably shouldn't be. <laughs> I just need to be a little bit closer. I might be able to dish out some good damage. We'll find out. Probably spread these two out from each other, though. Damn, it takes forever to get down there. That's crazy. We have Featherfall potions. I do not. Seriously, tempted to just jump. Oh my god. I How big is that radius? Oh no. Okay. Gotta really be careful of whatever that. I don't know, man. Take you. 
That was crazy. Got to make sure it doesn't say marked for negation. Okay, it doesn't say it over Gal's head. It says it over the Guardian of Faith's head. If I can use like dominate monster on this thing, that would be crazy. Otto's irresistible laughter on an elder brain cannot be charmed. Hmm, what do we want to do here? The Netherese or blast and just end it right now. I think that was a good play. Oh, you know what I'm worried about? When this thing blows up is... Oh, crap. Hold on. Let's go back to Gale. It's going to take down... It might take down that platform right here. I don't have Misty Step anyways. Come on. We got this. We got this. Trying to do the black hole without getting wolf in it. Perfect. Oh, there we go. Let's go. Okay, that orb's about to blow up. Oh no! Where'd Gal go? Gal is dead! <laughs> what? This is crazy! There's nowhere else to go! Except over here! Come on, we need big hits! Whoa! It's only Shadowheart alive right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, Orpheus is still alive. Alright, hold on. Okay, we gotta we gotta do something here. We gotta do something. Be very careful of wolf here. Hold on. Got 40 HP left. I don't know if I can survive another another round. All right, Wolf, let's go, baby. Oh, you got no. Damn it, we don't have any actions right now. Teleport to an area and deal 2 to 16 damage where you land. The impact blast spreads in a 10 foot zone. I don't know what happens if I teleport on top of this thing. It looks like, let me try this. That looks like I'm still, still landing. It worked. A little bit of damage, right? I think it did. 
Oh, God bless. Oh. Everybody's dead except Shadowheart. It's up to Shadowheart. Oh, got Orpheus too. Okay. I'm looking on the left at the portraits over here. I didn't see Orpheus. All right. So what we're going to do... <sighs> Let's use Orpheus first. Game over. legacy the grand design once again ended by my line the brain is on the cusp of its final thought and it's taking all of orpheus's strength to keep it there an opportunity perhaps what would happen if orpheus died in in the fight in the previous fight all right an opportunity perhaps let's see Can betray Orpheus, dominate the brain, and become the absolute? How is that even an option? And I have so many bonuses too. Do I just do I change everything right now? Was I deceiving you all with my RP this entire time? With my ultimate goal of just becoming the absolute? Command the brain to destroy all tadpoles and then itself. My master, I must obey. I must end. Hopes. Nightmares and the screams of legions upon legions of unborn mythids. The pain rips through you, obliterating all thought, all feeling. Your tadpole burns in your brain. First time in a long time, your thoughts are entirely your own. And then, gravity. Make it to the harbor. Wow. Speechless right now.
Yes. I remember this music from the panel from Hells that's getting me so pumped up right now. I'm so sad that this game is over. It was worth it for this. I was banned from Sorceress Sundry, so I'm happy that it was destroyed a little bit. Look at Karlak. She doesn't have any no <laughs> clothes on. This moment is for savoring. There will be tadpoles to snack on later. My powers, they're draining. Just like Mazura said they would. A small price to pay in the grand scheme of things. We did it. The nether brain is dead. Against all odds, we cured ourselves. Free from the parasite. Free from the prospect of ceramorphosis. I can hardly believe it. We will not become accursed illithids. Not to cast any slights on you, of course. Your present form is but a sign of your gallantry. Even when my time in the prism stretched out like eternity, when escape seemed impossible, I never lost hope. I knew that my destiny was to liberate my people. To return to them triumphant. I was wrong. It seems I can only fulfill one part of my destiny. My people will be liberated, but I cannot return to them. Not like this. You helped me destroy that abomination. Now help me destroy myself. You must kill me. Man, Orpheus. Do it quickly. I cannot live in this skin a moment longer. What a guy. I'm so happy that we decided to save him now. We really had no idea what was right and wrong throughout this entire journey. So happy that it turned out. I mean, I don't want to kill him right now, but... Happy that we saved him. You're a mind flare, but you're still you, aren't you? Yes. But for how long? My mind screams. It will never stop until it has slipped away from me entirely. I will not be Gake. I did what I did to save my people. The rest is up to them. Someone else must rise within the ranks to lead the revolution against Vlakith. Give me my freedom from this form. Release my soul to the astral seas, while I still have one to call my own. Wish one of his people would do this. Let's try a persuasion check. Hopefully he doesn't get mad at this. You may not be able to return to your people, Orpheus, but you deserve to live to see their future. I'll use my last inspiration point on Orpheus. Absolutely a true hero. A true hero of the world and his people. This can't be... 
this. I, I, I don't know if the game on the back end is like working to help me out or something. That's insane. I could do this a million times and never get that. Perhaps you are right. I may not be the one to lead my people, but I can still bear witness to their glory. I shall find a place for myself in a corner of these realms. For even in darkness, the stars of Tunarath will shine upon me. Wow. You were a worthy ally. Freedom is freedom, no matter the fall. I hope he finds peace with his newfound nature. It's the least he deserves. I'm getting a little teary-eyed right now, man. This is... It's crazy to be at the end of this game right now. The Gith Yankee are leaving. It would have been hard to imagine parting ways from them peacefully once. With the Gith Yankee gone, there's nothing left but the silence of the city. Smoldering, waiting to be rebuilt. But it seems that Gale's mind is elsewhere. The crown. It's somewhere in the Giontha. If I salvage the stones, I can reforge it. The power of Carsus would be in my hands. But what then? What would I do with it once I have it? Perhaps it's best you leave it where it is, Gale, lest anyone should ever be tempted by such power. I'm hesitant to say that, though, because I'm assuming that others probably know that the crown is in the bottom of Grey Harbor. But we'll go with it. A wise suggestion. I felt a hubris once before and landed myself with this orb. I think I'd rather not make the same mistake again. If this adventure has taught me anything, is that there are things in this world far more valuable than power. Besides, growing quite fond of this merry band of ours, but I'd quite like to see what happens to it. I'm sure Mistra will summon me soon enough, but until then, I propose we celebrate our victory the mortal way, with a drink in our hands and reckless abandon in our hearts. Ah, that might be the smartest thing you've ever said, Gail. <laughs> what do you think? Time for a quick one before the work begins again? We should stay in the city and help to rebuild it. Perhaps we can circle back to that one once the fires have died and the rubble settled. I do think we deserve a little rest. I honestly don't mind what we do once we get to the... Ow! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, no. oh god. Well, it was... It was nice when it lasted. Ah! I, I'm sorry. I, I have to go. Wow. I doubt we'll ever see that face basking in the sun again. Oh, man. Now we, we got Carlac. soldier. The city's going to be all right. And so are you. Engine's finally cooked. Held on just long enough. So, how'd I do? You were spectacular in every way, Carlac. So are you, my friend. 
My companion. I adore you. Careful! Hot! I never gave up. I did my best. I did my best. Oh, it's the one thing I can't beat, isn't it? I wanted to live in my city with my friends. But life is for the living. And I saw... Don't allow this. Karlak, you're coming with me. Back to Avernus. You can't. Yeah. It's your decision, Karlak. You have to choose. Hope she goes to Avernus. So, what do you say? Die here now, or live on with the blade of Avernus at your side. Zariel won't touch you. I swear it, Karlak. Fine. I'll go. Well, with you. But we have to go. Now. I can't hang on much Come on, longer. go, go, go. That was close. It's over, and it's all because of you. You, who were destined to become a thrall. Thanks to you, there will be no illithid empire, no death god's tyranny. You have earned your place amongst the legends of the Sword Coast. You are the saviors of Baldur's Gate. Oh. What a phenomenal, phenomenal experience. I can easily say that that's one of the best games that I've ever played in my entire life. And I'm so happy that Larian was the one to make it because they are bringing in probably thousands and thousands and thousands, if not hundreds of thousands, possibly millions of people into the CRPG genre. Thank you all so much for coming along with me on this very long Let's Play series. But I appreciate you guys so much. It was so much fun to do content like this. I've been avoiding Let's Play content for most of my YouTube career because it's not a great way to grow a channel. And now that I finally did it and there was a lot of support for this series, I am forever thankful to you guys. So thank you very much. And I was told by a few people that they might have put my name in the credits somewhere, but I think it's probably way, way at the end in the special thanks section so perhaps i'll fast forward the video if you guys want to see that and we have made it to the special thanks section of the end credits and as you guys can see right there wolf heart fps super nice of larian to do that for me obviously they didn't have to pretty cool to be in the end credits i am going to leave a link below in the video description to a video that shows the entire end credits if you'd like to go watch them it's over 30 minutes long which is really awesome, and it just shows you how much Larian cares about everyone that has anything to do with their games. I'm a little bit worried about copyright with all the music, so I'm not going to play it all out myself, but I do recommend that you go watch it. And that's going to be it for this Let's Play series. Hopefully I can do some more Let's Play series in the future for some other games. I'll definitely continue to live stream this game right here on this channel. But for the most part, we're going to be back to more regular content from here on out. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.